We recently installed a nice set of fuel wheels on our 2015 Ram, so today we're going to complement them by installing the set of fender flares. These are rivet style fender flares designed to fit your 2009 to 18 Ram 1500. They're made of heavy duty ProGuard ABS with a texture black finish that can be painted to match the color of your truck and they also have a riveted style perimeter for an aggressive look. They're designed to bolt right onto your Ram and they offer 2 inches of additional tire coverage. For more information and pricing, click the link in the description down below. Now let's get to the install. Tools you'll need for this installation, 8mm socket, quarter inch ratchet, a trim panel removal tool or a flathead screwdriver, and a Phillips screwdriver. The first thing we're going to do for this install is install the provided rubber trim on the top edge of all the flares. Now do the same thing for the rest of the flares. We have the rubber trim installed onto the flares. Now we can install the plastic bolts. Place a bolt through each hole on the outside of the flare. And then on the back side, install the push nut. Just simply push down on the push nut and it will slide over the bolt, locking it in place. Do this for the rest of the holes on all of the flares. We're at the front driver's side of the truck. Now we have to remove this factory mug guard. There's two 8mm bolts that need to be removed. Once you get the two 8mm bolts out, there's one push pin on the bottom. Remove this 8mm bolt that secures the fender liner to the fender on the rear of the front fender. And then this one on the front of the fender. There's two clips that need to be placed on this front fender. One is going to go right here on the front of the front fender. The second clip goes on this oval hole that's on the very top of the fender. This front flare can now be installed. We're going to start off by securing it with the front factory screw. Then another factory screw on the very bottom. Then proceed with the rest of the screws. Okay, all the screws are in. Now you can repeat the same process for the flare on the other side, then move on to the rear. We're at the rear of the truck now. Pretty similar process to the front. This mug guard has to be removed. There's two 8mm screws and then clips on the bottom. Remove the two clips on the bottom. Next, remove the rest of the screws that secure the fender liner to the fender. At the top of the fender, you'll see a hole where there's no clip for a factory screw. So you're gonna install a provided clip so you can install one of the provided screws. Once you get this on, you can place the flare onto the fender. Line up the holes on the flare with the factory holes on the fender and install the factory screws. Once you get the screw installed on the front, move on to the rear. Now you can move on to the rest of the screws. Okay, we got this flare installed. We can repeat the same process for the other side of the truck and our install is done. Okay, we got the fender flares installed on our 2015 Ram and it's really making this thing look a lot more aggressive. I'm loving the way this truck is starting to look. Installing them is pretty simple. I'd say give yourself two or three hours to do it and before you know it, you'll be heading off road.